from Los Angeles, California, born and raised. I went to school at Howard University where I studied supply chain management, where I decided that I wanted to pursue business and be my own type of boss. That's where I started my own clothing line and I was creating clothes where I could be, I could express myself in unique ways. And then I decided I wanted to learn more about finance so that way I could figure out the perfect way to launch a business, but still give back to the community which enabled me to come back to LA. And that's where I was helping businesses with their overall production. So with their cut and sew, with their sublimation and any type of style with the clothing that they were doing. And that's how SICE was born as a way to be a springboard for the black community. So teaching in different ways, whether it was production, whether it was actually mentoring people and then giving back to the community in unique ways, we decided we wanted to pivot and we wanted to continue by coming out with a collection called Protect Black People. And Protect Black People was directly with tapping into e-commerce. With e-commerce, we started to give back to different nonprofit organizations within the Black community. And it started to transcribe when we got into handbags, 3D printing, embossing, and unique ways of creating apparel. Um, it's, it's been a journey. We've been able to solidify and create a, a platform that's had over 80,000 people that are part of this. And a big part of it is community. So with community, we've just continuously pivoted, we've continuously adjusted and we've listened to what people want. And we've continued to make innovative products that keep getting better and better and better while giving back to the hubs and the different organizations that helped us get to where we are as well. The one piece of advice that I have for everyone is to constantly re, to constantly evaluate what you're doing and figure out unique ways to pivot, grow, and then help those that are around you. There's just because you're not actively out advocating for something does not mean that you're an activist and does not mean that you're not part of that community. Everybody can give back in their unique ways. So as a designer, you can contribute in unique pieces, whether it's through art, whether it's through creativity, whether it's just through being your own person, you can always inspire other people. So your art isn't everything, continue to do what you do and inspire those that are around you.